The Kingwood Park boys are the 4A defending champions and they look like one of the teams to beat this year. Last year, they narrowly defeated Houston, Stratford and Alamo Heights. In fact, Kingwood Park beat Stratford by only 10 points and returned most of their swimmers here at State. And we've handled it the past years. Um, we've talked about how this year, going in, we're not actually the favorite. We're not seated first. And so we actually feel no pressure and um, we're comfortable that way. Stratford had a very strong preliminary round yesterday and they're hoping to improve on their second place finish from last year. We really felt like Alamo Heights and Kingwood Park were gonna, were gonna be favorites along with us kind of last year. It came down to the three teams right at the end of the meet and we thought it'd be more of the same this year. And uh, it's kind of stacking up where, you know, our goal of, of winning, if we, if we take care of business tomorrow and, you know, avoid mistakes, I, I think we'll be in good shape. But uh, Kingwood Park uh, has won three in a row, so they're not gonna go away easily. It's gotten a lot tougher the last couple years. I mean, the quality has gotten better. Um, the top end, there's a few swimmers that are, you know, Division One swimmers here. So, I mean, there's always that capability, but the main thing is the quality has gotten a lot better over the last two, three years. Another school to look out for is Dripping Springs, who won three events in the prelims Friday. We've never had this many top three finishes. We've got three uh, in the number one seed in individual events, and both our medley relays are seated fifth. So, no, we've never had it had them all finish that well. So, no, we've never gone into finals with this much um, excitement. Meanwhile, on the girls' side, first goes the defending champions. They won by 100 points over Magnolia West last year. But this season, West is back and much stronger. They had several first place finishes in the prelims yesterday. I think Highland Park's girls, uh, they had a great great prelims. Uh, of course, Magnolia West is right there with them. That'll be, that'll be a great great meet between the two of them. Every year it's, it gets a lot tougher. It really does. Uh, all the way from, from every event, especially the, uh, the, the distance uh, girls freestyle events got a lot, got a lot faster. It's great for 4A. Expect a lot of fast times and records to fall.